We're recording. Got it. Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. Woo, we're in. We got each of the uh, entry level Evan, Evan Williams. Williams. And we're going to test it. Mash and charcoal filter style bourbon. Baby. Entry level style. <laughs> All right, we're in. So we did the live. This is what I was wearing. We did this with Jonathan Bray. So you're re-seeing the same uniform. You love this hat. It's a little small for your head. Well, the Army doesn't want you having a big old floppy hat when you're in. in case you didn't They know. do now. No, they don't. They don't like so anyway, products. I was in the liquor store, and I'm thinking, we need some bourbon bottles. Yeah. I'm going to start opening these. We've only done Evan Williams' small batch. Right. Uh, or not small batch, sorry. Single barrel. I'm agreeing. Um, years ago. Whatever you say. It was in my kitchen upstairs. Okay. I think you were wearing the cat shirt. Or comments about the cat shirt. <laughs> ah, the cat shirt. And that's shirt. off the top of my head. I need to wear the cat shirt. A lot of people, since we did Evan Williams single barrel, we've had a lot of people recommend. Pour that. I, I don't know if anybody's. This is the this is the the base the entry level Evan Williams here. I don't know that anybody's recommended this one, but a lot of people have said the black label, the bottled in bond, right. and the small batch, which isn't here. You need Not to here. try. Right, try it. So, these are all, and we'll talk prices and stuff later. And we'll talk charcoal filter. The green label Evan Williams, 40 per, I think it's 40%. Kentucky straight, yep, 40%. Kentucky straight bourbon How whiskey. Much? How much? Sour mash, charcoal filtered. Well, what is, it, is it still bourbon if it's charcoal filtered? Some say yes, some say no. It is. Legally, we have noticed. Legally, yes. We have noticed a few bourbon, Kentucky straight bourbons that sure. are charcoal filtered. They can do Isn't that. Isn't that the same with Jack Daniels? It is. I'm just Tennessee saying. Tennessee whiskey, Lincoln County method. This bottle runs eight or nine dollars. <laughs> no, shut it. Yeah. Shut uh, the, the black, door. The black label Evan Williams that you just poured. Yes. Uh, Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey, 43% ABV. All right. All it says is extra aged in oak. Extra aged. Now this this extra bottle and bond version has a little strip off cap, so it's yep. a little fancier. So eight or nine dollars, twelve or thirteen dollars. Our we were eight dollars, twelve dollars. This is the bottle and bond, twenty dollars. Holy moly, you're breaking the bank. All three of these bottles, 40, 40 bucks. Fourteen. Watch, because I poured. Oh. I wanted a little less. Uh, that is our uh, new Spartan helmet. Actually, yes. the Spartan helmet and the Android are both new. We uh, we decided to get both. I ordered and the what Android. You, what does well, Roy Duff call them? The Warrior Pack. The Warrior Pack. You can you can get one of each. But anyway, yeah, we had get ordered, a discount if you buy two at the same time. Originally, we or, just ordered the Android head. That's what we'd been going to. And, and then, then I Bart was mad. Was I kept like, pushing I, the Spartan helmet? Yeah, I pushed the Spartan helmet to be on the coin, and I was like, "We need it on the glass because it's the best." And he's like, "No, it's not. The Android's better." I'm so like, we Shut ordered up. both. We got them both. One of them's old. I am Spartacus. The other one is. I can't remember what was the uh, Will Smith movie where he's with the. Uh, I am Legend. I no. Well, there's that. I thought of that, but there's the one where the uh, the android that. He thinks I robot. A, I robot. I knew there was an I am Spartacus. I robot. See how quick that was. That was fast. I should have got Coin. it. Coin simple. Uh, I've got 213, 219, and 222. That's a 222, or also known as a triple deuce. Well, they got mixed up a little bit. 217 here on the bottled in bond. 215 on <laughs> I think the black I grabbed label. Your glass and screwed and, it up. Oh, that's right. 216 on I, the green label. I almost want the triple deuce. That's all I'm saying. Just two, the two, sound two. of it. Yeah, the triple deuce makes me. Uh, okay. I usually keep the 57 Chevy. So let's start with the green label. This is 40%. All the way to the right. Kentucky straight <clears> bourbon <throat> whiskey <clears throat> and a sweet, sweet nose. Ooh, uh, smoky, okay. peppery. Now, this was on purpose as well, was sure. opening these on video. Okay. We haven't had these. Never. I've I, I've never had any of these. Me neither. These are the neck pours, but I really wanted to see just how do they stack up? How well, do they compare? Before I even sample, I can tell you there's a lot of very affordable whiskey. That's mm -hmm. good. Yeah. Is it usually the best? It's not usually the best, but it's good. 
you can get some good values, and I'm hoping at eight or nine dollars, this yeah, green label's a good value. Especially since they're running it through what looks like maybe a Winkin, a Winkin, Winkin, a Winkin County method, a Winkin County method, a Lincoln County method. Forty percent, so it is a little bit light. It is Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. It's been charcoal mellowed. What they say, charcoal <laughs> filtered, filter. charcoal charcoal filtered. Mm -hmm. Yep. Some use charcoal mellowed. Jack Daniels mellows. Which actually, you had a good point before we went. Before we hit the record button, you pointed out maybe it's charcoal filtered to take some of the harshness and right. smooth out some of the edges. I guarantee it smooths out the edges. Um, all right, vanillas, peppers, cinnamons all over this bad boy. Mm. Cinnamons everywhere. Wow. Yeah. A little bit of popcorn uh, corn at the end there, a little mm. butter. A little butterscotch. Four... Eight nine dollars, forty. It's the forty percent's coming off a little bit light. I expected that. Yeah, not bad though. It's it's definitely not revolting. Oh it's, no, you know it's not turning the taste buds. Yeah, off. no 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 revolt there at all. Mm. The corn's a little more accentuated, but not bad. The cinnamons are all over it. I get a little bit of the charcoal, not much. A little bit of that charcoal filtering. Yeah. It definitely removed some of the harshness. Definitely. And I get it a definitely dusty, smooth it I out. get a dusty corn, which is always good. That's very nice. That's very impressive. That's not bad at all. You, you know, know, I've always said the Heaven Hill six year bottled in bond is one of the best twelve year twelve dollar mm -hmm. bottles you can buy. Well. That's uh that's in competition bad. for one of the best not eight, bad. nine dollar bottles. Well, you can here's buy. the deal. We're getting ready to have a bunch of neighbors over. And, uh, you know, I don't know the neighbors too well. We're going to have the whole the whole development over. We're going to do a fire pit deal. Mm -hmm. Well, some of them know what I do, so they're expecting whiskey. Mm -hmm. I can have about four of those online, handing them out. And if they pour Coke in it, do it. Who cares? Whatever you want. Yeah, you can put fruit juice in there. I don't care. And then a couple people will be like, hey, do you have XYZ? <laughs> come with me. And they'll come get a little something. So, like it. That's really not bad. No. That's not bad at all. Not bad. Um, I actually think that well, charcoal filter definitely rounds yeah, off the think, edge. Yeah. It's a it smart to move. Have. Yeah. Because yeah. it tastes fine. Mm -hmm. It tastes good. Yeah. It's not going to blow your socks off. No. It's not going to be the whiskey of the year. <laughs> but is it worth... Unless you're in a certain book. Is that worth be. $9? <laughs> definitely. <laughs> right. Um, yeah. Mm. Moving to the black, a little bit more on the nose. There's a little bit more present, a little bit more saying, hey, hmm. I'm stronger, I'm richer. I just get a little more dusty. 43%. Mm, okay, vanilla. Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. Oh, wow. Yeah. Come on. I got a touch of clove. Vanilla. Good, strong Mexican vanilla. Mm. Rich Mexican vanilla. You know? I like that. There's just there's just a little bit more punch to it than there is with green. Mm. There's a little bit more. The ABV is showing. A lot more caramels. Cinnamon, clove, sugar, clove. I get no. less cinnamon. I get a lot less cinnamon here, which is fine. I like the cinnamon. I get a little clove at the forefront. And then dusty corn mid. Hmm. Sweet vanilla finish. Yeah, that's very nice too. Caramels, You're right? Butterscotches, cinnamons, vanillas. Nice, normal, forty-three percent bourbon, worth twelve dollars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I need to get me a I brace. See. I need to get a brace of these. <laughs> a brace of conies. A brace. I I'll have them at holsters when all the neighbors are over. I heard you got whiskey. Pa Pow! I'm pouring some for you. I expected harsh. I expected. Uh, mm. Bitter youth. I expected young whiskey. Well, uh, a young whiskey. Right. I expected to be able to taste white dog. How many of these have we had? Oh, yeah, no white dog. Uh, where the white dog is showing. Right. I'm not getting any white dog no. in there at all. Uh -uh. It's past the stage of white dog. Well, I think the uh, the charcoal filter mm -hmm. uh, took that white dog out of that one. Yeah. All right. I'm moving on to the bottle and bond. Now we're always impressed with bottle and bond. I think so for the most part. I there's not a bottle and bond imparts some magic, 
as far as I'm concerned. Now, I think I think you did goof up as well. The okay. last one we did, I don't remember which one it was, it just aired. Uh, bottled and bond has to be 50%. And yes. you stated minimum was 50. It could be over. Oh. But then someone commented, and I, I, that's the way, I, I think it was Jason um, Coates who commented mm-hmm. and said bottled and bond has to be 50%. Yes. It's not minimum 50%. Mm-hmm. No, I, I, it has to be I, I probably misstated. It's got to be at least 50. No, minimum, it, it 50. Bottle in bond can't be right, anything well, else. The, oh, you're saying it can't be above even? No, it can't be 60% in bottle in bond. Bottle well, in bond has to be would 50. They? Why would they, though? If that's yeah. the minimum, why wouldn't you? <coughs> so why, bottle, why couldn't they go above? So bottle in bond has to be four years. Yeah, I knew Government that. controlled warehouse. Sure. And 50% Some kind ABV. Of strap. But yeah, you can't go. It has to be 50% ABV. It can't be 52. Nope. I'm you, calling crap on and, that. And I'll tell you, I haven't seen a bottle in bond that wasn't 50 Well, neither have I, but that's 50%. I always figured it's because if the minimum is 50, why would you go over and have 54 hitting your bottom line when all you got to do to get bottle and bond status is hit 50? I would be surprised if they were mad at you if you exceeded the 50%. Though. Right. But you can't. They have to be 50. Fifth across the board, fifty percent. Like, and I haven't seen any bottle in bonds that aren't fifty percent. Right. If it's bottle in bonds, 50%. I always figured that was economic reasons, though. Because why would you? Woo. Okay, a little bit more on the nose. <laughs> dusty cinnamon. Right. Yep. Dusty, oaky, caramel, vanilla, cinnamon. Doesn't and again, this is labeled sour mash. It's not labeled. There's no charcoal, mellowing, charcoal it's a filtering. sour mash, sour mash. This has a charcoal, charcoal filter. filter. Right. Now, don't know if charcoal filtered. Whoa, how did we miss that? <laughs> sour mash sour, on the other side. Genuine sour mash, charcoal filter. How did we miss that? Extra aged in oak. The black just says extra aged. Yeah, in oak. and then genuine sour mash. So this is holy moly, that's charcoal filtered as well. The bottled and bond is Wait, charcoal filtered. So it can be called bourbon and be. Don't tell that to filtered? the. Don't tell that to the Jack Daniels crowd. <laughs> now we almost had the 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 debate comes, Tennessee whiskey. Mm-hmm. Jack Daniels is labeled Tennessee whiskey. If you use the label Tennessee whiskey, it has to go through the Lincoln County process. Unless you're grandfathered. With one exception. Pritchard's. Might be two. Might be two. I thought, it was, I thought Pritchard's I thought was Pritchard's the only one. Pritchard's, and I think there's one other one, but it's real small. So when you call Jack Daniels a bourbon, people get offended. On both sides. But again here, and we've had a few lately, Kentucky straight bourbon whiskeys that are charcoal filtered. And charcoal mellowed. Yes. And they're still a bourbon. It fits the law of bourbon, even with the charcoal filtering. So that doesn't exclude it. Did you taste yet? Yeah. Smooth. Um, vanilla. Mm. Vanilla mm. caramel wow. drizzle. Wow. Yeah. With a slight touch of creme. Meaning creme. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's a creamy yeah. caramel. Mm-hmm. That is... A yeah. delicious $20 had, bottle. Yes, I've had custards that taste like this when they've got a caramel drizzle on it, and I love it. Mm. And I'm going to be buying this. <laughs> that one's being bought. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. And, I, and I'm with you. I'm not lying. The neighbors are coming over in yeah. mass, and I'm going to have all three of these, and this will be the, the one I'll be pouring like there's no end in sight. And then anybody asks for a little something extra, they're getting a the black and a little something more of the white. And then anybody that names, like, hey, I heard you got a Yamazaki 18, I'll be like, oh. And then I'll have to segregate them aside and sneak them in the house to get a little of that. Uh, the bottle in bond is everything amplified, mm-hmm. like, like you would expect. Good. I mean, well done. There's not, this could be four years. Some bottle in bond, is four. I mean, minimum, yeah. Right. Some give you a six-year. Uh, Henry McKenna gives you a 10-year bottle in bond. Sure. This one doesn't have an age, so that's, it's at least four. Good. I got a little corn corn mashiness there. No harshness. Mm-mm. Well-rounded. Mm-hmm. Good on the palate. 
that's an incredible value at twenty bucks. That's an incredible value at twelve bucks. This is an incredible value at eight bucks. Now I've got to hesitate. We could have the dummy effect here. Next thing you know, yeah. Next thing you know, where the people are rushing out mm -hmm. and they're paying some kind of secondary market price <laughs> for something. Now I got to tell you though, um, mass bill wise. I'm not getting a lot of, and I don't know if, this, if these are weeders. I don't think they are. I think there's probably, maybe there's low rye mash bill. If there is, corn. yeah, if there is, the rye isn't that no. prevalent, prevalent. Right. It's not well, really coming at, jumping out at you. Corns are cheaper grain, too. They almost come off more as weeders, though, just being sweeter. Well, you're good on the I just get corn, corn, and more corn. I don't think the Evan Williams is a weeded mash bill, though. I think it's rye, but it's very. If there's rye, it's very light. It's it does not have that much of a lot of rye. It doesn't have that much of an influence on it. Right. So, I think these are all worth it. Great buys if you haven't tried them. Do now. I will tell you in the liquor store. So you got the green label, you got the black, you got the white. Then there's a small batch bottle. And then there's the single barrel. You'll probably find them in most liquor stores. I'm impressed. I expected youth Harsh. and harshness. That's what I thought. I expected some of the same here, and maybe this would be decent. Well, sorry, sorry, Evan Williams. I mean, we haven't had you. No, you're, you're, I thought price the bottle wise, and bond would be good. Yeah, and then I thought, eh, but then I saw the charcoal filter. I thought, well, you never know, uh, but. I, I had hopes for this one, and they're all good. Uh, well, okay. I expected decent and really probably not good. Especially okay. for $8 and $12. That's I unbelievable. Yeah. All good. Uh, don't be afraid to pick up God. Evan Williams You know what this makes me wish? This makes me wish we were buying cases of, of bourbon in 2002. Because I think we could have got, I think we could have got, well, there's 12 for 20 bucks. Yep. That's all I'm saying. All I'm saying. Traveling dummies. Oh, you got a great one. I love this. Brandon Brandon Temple emailed us. Yes. Now he didn't have his coin with him. He, he oh, does have coin. You got to carry the coin in your pocket, Brandon. He is flying an Airbus three twenty one. Big boy. Over Wichita. Not him, but the plane. From a ways off, but he snaps a few pictures yep. from the cockpit. Yeah, flying over Wichita on an Airbus, snaps a few pictures, and he says he wish he would have had his our coin oh, with him. Would have been so great. maybe next time we can see he's Brandon in level Temple flight. Will. He's level. Yep. Patreon shout-outs. Mm, we got a few of these. We're going to be shouting them. Right. Lee Rayner. Lee, Lee Rayner. I know. Wait, I wasn't sure if you were ready or not. Thank also you, Also known as Scotch on the Bayou. Ooh, Bayou. Uh, check Lee out. Uh, she also started a blog recently. No, wait, uh, you said she. I'm going to say I yeah. assumed Lee was a he. Nope, Lee is Lee's a she. Lee's a she. Way yep. to go, Lee. I'm glad to have you on board. Her husband is an actor. Ah. Yeah, been in a lot. I mean, uh, not like mainstream top build actor, but he's been, he's like been a, uh, uh, what do you call them, the extra actors that come in. Sure, uh, an extra. Uh, extras? There you go. An extra. In like, he's been in like 200 and some movies Holy or something Holy like moly. Yeah. Very cool. We need an agent, actually. Yeah. <laughs> we got to have Lee reach out to us. My, how about Michael Linsalata? Lin, I would say Linsalata. Linsalata. Michael, Michael Linsalata. I love that last name. Got to get a little thing. Linsalata. <laughs> Linsalata got Salata. Way to go. Look at that. Uh, Michael's a $2 Patreon supporter. And, and Thank you very much. No cap. Lee was a. If we uh, went hog wild crazy on shows, he just keeps giving. We usually don't point that Sorry, out. Sorry, I'm but... pointing it out because he's a super giver. <laughs> He's a super giver with no cap. When you got no cap, and I'll give you an extra little ting ting. Nick Keen came in as a one dollar supporter. So we love thank you very all much, Nick. All the supporters. Thank you, Nick. Nick Keen. We we do. We love and, and here's a deal yeah. on Patreon. If you can only come in for a couple months and you have to back out, you have to yeah. lower your support. Yeah. Thank you very much for your time you was here. We appreciate it. Everything thank helps you. us. Yep. We do have a special coin that you can get when you hit a hundred, and we got a special shirt you get when you hit five hundred. So if you stay on for a long time, we give you some bonuses. If you've been with us for three years and you have to drop, hey, we appreciate the time that you've been here. We appreciate the support sure. you've given it's us. All Don't awesome. feel bad. Uh, you can always come back in later for more. That's right. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we do put your name up on a slide so your name gets into a show. Yep. So, all right. 
Sweet. What do you got? Uh, you know, I'm really going to go. I think I'll end off with the black label. Really? I'm going to end off with the white. I like the white. I was sipping yeah. on that green, though, and that's fine, too. When you drink with us, you never drink alone. We toast to family, friends, good health, and home. Pour an Irish, a bourbon, a rye. But if you scotch. Scotch it! You, you scotch, scotch gods. Slaunch it, dummies. Dummies. that subdivision down there look at that you can see two little uh you see two little uh, go up a little bit there what is I that i don't know it's like a whole nother city i don't know <laughs> <laughs> i don't know analyze it here yes. and figure out what that okay. is it could Sorry. be derby could be and yeah, it's probably derby could be maze so he's flying north to could south be goddard could be anything park city <laughs> You named a bunch of little cities. <laughs>